Three's Carrie Keene is at a Three River College in, in Sykeston. It is a polling place for New Madrid County. She has more on what they've been seeing and what the big topics are in Missouri tonight. Cars all day at Three Rivers College in New Madrid County. It's been a really busy election day in southeast Missouri. Lines at all the polling places. The biggest things on the ballot this cycle in the state of Missouri are constitutional amendments, and one of those is Amendment 5. This would take the Missouri National Guard out of the umbrella of the Department of Public Safety. Then the National Guard would be its own entity. Representatives from the National Guard say that really is ideal because it eliminates the middleman between the National Guard and the governor. The National Guard would still be under the governor and under control, but it allows them to do their own budgeting and their own work without a filter or middleman. It increases our ability to get legislative access and it decreases the amount of time that it takes us to get to a state emergency. Uh, because it opens up a better line of communication between us and the governor. It'll be good for the Guard, and ultimately that means it's good for the citizenry of Missouri. Members of the National Guard do say it's been difficult this election cycle. They don't have the funding for things like campaigns or signs for something of this matter. They it said it's been hard to get the word out. They're hoping for a yes vote tonight, though, and we will continue to keep track on those results as they roll in in southeast Missouri. Reporting in Sykeston, Missouri, Carrie Keene, News 3.